Hello everybody, welcome to Minutes with PJ. Today's date, April 17, 2016. Our discussion is going to be on negotiator and to negotiate. We know in 2 Samuel 3.13, King David said, All right, but I will not negotiate with you unless you bring me my wife, Michal, which is Saul's daughter. In Ruth 4.4, 4, so I thought to inform you, saying, By it before those who are sitting here, and before the elders of my people, I will redeem it, redeem it, but if not, tell me that I may know, for the, there is no one but you to redeem it. And I am after you. And he said, I will redeem it. In Matthew 26, 14 through 16, Then one of the twelve, named Judas Iscariot, went to the chief priest and said, What are you willing to give me to betray him to you? And they weighed out thirty pieces of silver to him. For them he began looking for a good opportunity to betray Jesus. Now we know King David negotiated with Abner to have his wife return to him. We know that Boaz negotiated to have Ruth redeemed because he was the kindred spirit redeemer, but he was only second in place. Jesus knew that one of the apostles, Jesus Iscariot, would betray him for the negotiation of only 30 pieces of silver. When Judas realized what he had done, he threw the money back to the Jewish leaders. Then took the, they took the money and provided it for a potter's field. Jesus, the negotiator, will negotiate for us with the Father in heaven if we truly believe in him and follow him completely. I want you to think about this, and I know you want Jesus to negotiate for you. Have a blessed Sunday.